Hi folks, welcome back to the channel. We're out here at Myrtle Beach National, the King's North Course. So an Arnold Palmer design. We're gonna have to have an Arnold Palmer today, don't you think, Griff? Absolutely, we're getting one on turn. So, showcasing the course. Gonna showcase most of my play, but then we're gonna get some other people involved as well. Uh, show maybe a hole from Blair, from Rich, from Griff, throughout this whole video, either nine holes or all 18. Uh, this will be a nine hole segment, front nine. But uh, Griff, what do you think of uh, the retreat trip so far down here to, to Myrtle Beach with the First Responder Golf Yeah, it's been, it's been amazing to be out here and uh, just kind of rewind and relax and uh, get out here with you guys. Been... Yeah, thanks for coming on the trip and glad we're able to accommodate. But we were here for some networking uh, with Jerry Carey. Go follow him on his Instagram and TikTok. He's gonna be in one of the videos from uh, Moreland, you've probably already seen that one before this one comes out, but uh, he helped us raise some money down here with networking and uh, looking forward to working with him again. So, got anything to add? Nope, I, I'm blessed to be out here and it's been a it's been a fun trip so far. Yep, glad he's out here. All right, love you all, stay self-aware. All right, folks, gonna have to do a voiceover here early on in this video. Here I am trying to talk, but I had a new microphone. I thought it was charged, but Obviously it wasn't, so I don't figure this out to like hold two or three, I think. So here's the opening drive at Kings North. Beautiful golf course, man. It, it's just tall pines, beautiful setting. So a good drive by me to open it up. Here's Blair, our uh, police officer with the foundation. He played D1 golf at High Point University, and uh, he's just starting to get back into the game more. and. Uh, yeah, watching him play, seeing some of the skills, especially with this, some of the spin he puts on the ball. Uh, yeah, I can see D1 golfer for sure. Uh, here's G, uh, Chief Nye, scratch golfer, one of the better senior players in Kansas City. Uh, yes, his swing might look unorthodox to some of you, but he gets it done, and that's all that matters in this game. There's Griff, a local Kansas City area police officer, trying to learn the game. Uh, we're trying to help him get better. But yeah, just having to do the voiceover. Like to show these type of shots, memories for the trip. Anyway, describing that I'm about 200 and, uh, if I remember right, about 215 out. And I got the four iron and that bunker there. Uh, I hit it kind of pull, a pull draw a little bit. So when it hits like just on the front of the green, it rolls to the back as you'll see here shortly. So, anyway, beautiful setting. I love the bunkering on that first hole. But there's where my uh, ball ended up, back of the green. Probably could have hit a five iron, obviously. Look how far I went by. <laughs> so, there's my approach shot. Comment below if you like the, the cactus shirt. I bought that for one of our retreat trips to Phoenix. And uh, I like the way it looks, the way it feels. But not a bad shot here. I think I left myself about an eight, eight footer there. And so these Bermuda greens, man, I was having trouble reading them. I think I left the face open on that one or I just didn't read that much break, I don't know. But anyway, on to hole number two. It's a par four, 390 yards. You'll see here on the tee shot that it just doesn't, it's well designed in my opinion. You can draw it over that bunker Fairway goes to the right a little bit, so if you hit it too far left, you'll uh, get end up in the trees or in the rough. So <clears throat> Blair here, his drive's gonna go, he didn't draw it enough, he didn't, uh, he ended up in the trees there to the right. As you can see, the shot tracer coming down. So I was trying to draw this one over the bunker and I kind of get a little, I, I get away with a little bit of a pull. Thankfully, it, you know, I don't hit it far enough anymore or it would have gone either in the trees or in that bunker there, as you see. So if I'm remembering right, I was probably about 125 out and uh, had a pitching wedge I went with. <laughs> Comment below if you like that fast walk up, speeding that video up. I was afraid of pulling this one left, left this one out. 
Not a bad leave overall, but with that club in your hand, you'd like to maybe put it a little closer. And here, you're gonna see is just a poor, poor effort. Either I was into the grain and just didn't read it properly or I just didn't hit it. But anyway, this is day two of our golfing on this Myrtle Beach trip. And that was just a dead pool. Anyway, bogey there on hole two. Hole three, beautiful golf hole. Look at that, bunkering. Uh, you can try to go for the green if you want. Clear the water or hit it over to the right there and have yourself probably 120 in, something like that. But those trees are menacing in the way. Blair hit an iron out there. I think it was a two iron and, and got into the fairway there. And I said, hey, hey why not? I'm, I'm on a trip, golf trip, having fun. I didn't draw it enough, but again, I was afraid of those trees. But this one made it into the bunker up by the green, as you're gonna see here. There's the volume back, there's the sound. All right, folks, green side bunker, job two. Thank you. Straight out. Sit. Too much through that. I think that's a line with less pace. The par. All right, folks, beautiful golf hole here. It's gonna be about 160 yards, according to my GPS, over water. How did you not catch it? No, I did good. Okay, okay you got the wind's just not taking it right. You got the wind, you got the ground after it. Oh, I hit it good. Too much draw spin, that counteracts it. Yeah. All right, bro, hit you a good one. Smart play, right. buddy. Back portion, fringe of the green. Not bad. All right, there's my ball over there on the fringe there. Yeah, I was into it. Get in the grain, Steve! I got it over here. Let it hit. You want to get that on video? What is it? It's a raccoon in the cart. The raccoon's up in the cart. He's getting some food. Go get his ass out. He's looking, he's looking for food. Yeah. Hey, you guys are catching those robbers like that. I know. Pushed it. I didn't hit it. Can't get used to the grain, folks. All right, folks, two bogeys because I can't get used to the grain out here. I'm going to have to adjust. That's golf. We got a raccoon in our cart looking for crackers. <laughs> or crack whores. I don't know which. What? <laughs> <laughs> All right, this is a beautiful hole here, hole five, but this tee box, but the gambler, Kenny Rogers is next. Right there, their island fairway. But this hole, let's take a look at it. Gotta clear that bunker, I'll give you a yardage on the bunker here in a second. And look, that tree hanging over, could be some problems. All right, folks, make your comments below. Hey, we're out on a foreign golf course. Beautiful setting here. Um, it's like 310 to this green that, hey, hit a shot and have fun. Even though you might not, the result might not turn out how you wanted. That one did for me, I got over the bunker. But have fun. So um, just comment below, tell me what you guys think. Even if the result's bad, you know you're having fun with that shot. Just it is what it is. You're out here with the fellas. So, all right, beautiful setting here on hole five and six. Love it. All right, folks, there's where my drive ended up. I got about probably 40 yard 
pitch shot up and over this sod wall bunker. I'm going to get closer to it and show you. But I got room. That pins. It looks like I got room. All right. I love it. Cool. I got room to get it up and over. All right. Here's the look from where I'm at. Get it, Grain. It did. Thank you. Griff, you ready for the gambler? Oh, I'm ready. That's a beautiful hole. You like Kenny Rogers? I do like Kenny Rogers. All right, yeah. All right, folks, here we go. The gambler. Take a read at that, pause it, read it. Oh yeah. She gonna take the cape? Oh, Rich with the T. Oh yeah, sir. Folks, I gambled and I'm about 182 and it's slightly into the wind. I gotta, I'm gonna choke down on this six iron. Land ahoy, land ahoy. <laughs> Hello, friend. All right, folks. I'm gambling for this eagle, big bird. Get up there! Look at that break. All right, bird dog on the gambler. All right, folks, 122.9. Got a pitch away as you get over this wall. All right, it's in a good enough spot. Man, this thing has some break to it. Probably should chip this, but heck. It got through there better than I thought it would. God, look at that break. All right, folks, we played miniature golf the other day, and there was better pin placements than this stupid pin placement. So let's see if I can even grind and make this. Let it go. Bogey. Gambler. All right, folks. Blair and I, on this part three, we're kind of waiting to hit, hit a wall. We're going to do a $20 closest to the pin. You in? Yeah, I'm down. 20 bucks? Yeah. All right. Yeah. And we're going to give it to Richie to hold for us. Little, little fun, different content Ooh. here. That crispy? Yeah, well, it's got a little bit of a little bit of a bent edge, but I think it'll still spin. Yeah, it'll still spin. It'll still spin. And we'll get you the yard in a second, but we're playing from the same tee boxes, so we thought we'd do something fun here. Yeah, why not? All right. Well,
What clubs are you walking up here with, Blair? Eight, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, I should probably go back and get something different. Here, folks, here's what we got, yardage-wise. 178, it's the end of the wind. I'm gonna have to go back and get different clubs. What are you playing? Oh, I got the Cobra Forge Tech. Iron's pretty forgiving, pretty good iron, though. Kind of gives you like that look of a of a blade, but it's kind of got that little cavity back, so it kind of helps me out a little bit. It's a little forgiving. I don't mind it, I like them a lot. Hey, uh, if you win, will you buy me a shake tonight? With that 20 bucks? Oh, absolutely. What, what flavor do you want? I like chocolate. I'll get you one too. Let me go ahead and get it. Let me just go ahead and get it. You just gonna go ahead and get it anyway? Yeah, I'll just go ahead and get you one. <laughs> we know who's gonna come closer. All right, what are you thinking, Blair, with this wind? and? I don't know. So we got 190, it's all the way back, right? That's playing 190. It back. looks back, yes. So either a knockdown four or a full five here. Because uh, I hit the ball so high. So maybe it's just capturing in that wind. Um, I'm okay being a little short as in like, you know, like front of the green. All right, I'm yeah. I have to go all the way back there. So I'm gonna hit a nice little five here, boys. All right, good luck. Thanks, man. Oh, you're on top of it. You got that one all day. I don't know, I still got a hit and that wind's blowing. So wait, let's clarify to everyone. Is it closest to the pin no matter if you're not on the green? No, let's, we'll stay on the green. If you gotta we'll, be on the green, if, and if we're not, we'll, we'll do a push. We'll do it the next hole, we'll the push. next part three. Double or nothing next hole. Ooh, he's talking <laughs> double or nothing. Yeah, if you don't hit it, we'll do double. It's a good one though. I'd rather, I'd rather, I'd rather lose than you hit a good one. Right. Oh, I'm over there with you. I have the number. All right, folks. I know it wasn't the content you wanted there. We tried to make it something special, but hey, it's just it wind. It makes you like feel like you're gonna have to swing a little bit extra. You know I, what I mean? It I gives agree. You that, like, you know, I'm gonna club up even though you already did. So <laughs> we'll we'll tell Chief Nye to keep that 20 bucks. The next part three. Uh, I say let's just play for that 20. No double or nothing. All right, that's fine. That's fair. All right. All right, folks. There's another turtle. Bunch of them out here. Bunch of them yesterday. Tough plan placement there. Blair and I will do our little gambling hole the next part three. Neither one of us hit the green and we're both in the bunker. You know, we should do closest to the pin from the bunker, but he's pretty pretty good from the bunker. I'll film it. But yeah, we'll just wait till I have a full swing. <laughs> All right, folks, no pressure on him. I talked him up to you. Not an easy bunker shot, is it? No, I got a big old hill to kind of go over here. And distance of it. I'm going to just try to hit up there and let it roll down and give me somewhere like a 20 foot putt, I'd be happy. See? Much better than me. Is it long? On the fringe or off the fringe? On the back fringe. Oh. Alright folks, I'll do my best here. I'm using a 54 since I gotta throw it further. Yeah, a little bit. You're more like left of the trees a little bit. Yeah, I don't have another one in my pocket. Sorry, I'm just trying, I'm just trying to figure something out real quick. Good kick save. All right, folks, hope you've enjoyed uh, the front nine here at Myrtle Beach National, the Kings North course. Um, fun time with the fellows on this trip, retreat trip down to Myrtle Beach, bringing uh, Griff and Blair. They're both police officers, and also we did some networking to raise some money down here in Myrtle Beach with Jerry Carey, so go give him a follow. But last hole here, hope you're enjoying 
me showcasing this golf course. I love doing this because I know when I travel, I love to try to find these courses on the internet besides their website, something different to give me a, a better perspective of the course I'm gonna go play. So anyway, thanks for watching. Come here. I don't have anything, bud, sorry. All right, folks, here's the pin placement. I am not in a good spot here, so I'm gonna have to hit this low probably, and I, I, I might take being in the bunker. Ah, oh, in the bunker, but it's skirted. It skirted that tree just barely. All right, folks, I'm gonna zoom in on this bunker shot. Get out. All right, didn't release all the way up there, but it's about 10 feet. All right, folks, that concludes the showcasing and the front nine here at uh, Myrtle Beach National Kings North. I've enjoyed the routing. So anyway, if you're ever down in the Myrtle Beach area, I recommend this course and stay tuned for the back nine. Griff, you got anything to add about the course? What do you think? It's a beautiful course. Uh, I love the sand and I love the water. So Griff likes being able to drive in these bunkers, don't you? <laughs> yeah, I do, that's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thanks for watching everyone. Stay self-aware and we love y'all. Love you guys. Old 10 to the right. Best drive of the day. Good swing. Down there. You come down out of the tree? Yeah. Hey Griff, what do you got down here? Got the G4s on. Alright. Oh, and, and my leg? And your tattoos. Yeah, Star Wars. Let me get out, let me get some sun on that. Yeah. You got Darth Vader, Luke. Alright. Are you the are you on the dark side or are you the Dark what? side's cooler. That's why. I mean, I'm if not. you're a cop, I'd have to call you dark side. Right. It's not probably a good thing. No. So. But they could kick ass. That dark they side can. could. They can. <laughs> you almost get a cop that way. All right, folks. 206 yards. This tree's in the way. There's the pin in the back. 206 middle. So I'm probably just gonna have to do like a little punch down there and let her run. Skirt that tree. All right, downwind to the left. Now, folks, I could probably maybe try to sling one, and let it ride the wind. But I'm gonna try to play this punch down there. Uh oh, it's fading. Oh! Ho, 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 ho! Nice yes, ball. sir! Yeah, it's rolling still. It's still going. Yeah. It's still going? It's, still it's back there. I'm going to say 15 feet. I think I'm going to start playing those shots like that the rest of the day. What do you think of that, girl? That was awesome. It kept rolling. Am I your only fan? You are. <laughs> oh, wait. Are you my only fan? <laughs> I'm your only fan. <laughs> so you subscribe to the Foot Finder. Yes. yes. <laughs> All right, buddy. All right, folks. Here's the eagle putt plane up there all right folks end of the grain on this one that's what i'm reading oh yes. eagle baby <laughs> yeah woo yeah. thank you <laughs> woo <laughs> oh, for the film <laughs> <laughs> 
so either the grain influenced it to go a little right at the end or i misread it but either way it's in the hole now for an eagle good way to start this back nine All right, nothing like coming off an eagle and then I dump it in the water here. 297 out, hybrid. Thank you. Is he setting up to try to mate? Lure, it's uh, another one? There's another one across the way over there. All right, see how close she got. Oh, didn't bring it. All right, eagle, then a double bogey, love it. All right, I'm gonna get a hole in one on this part three. Come on. All right. All right, Blair, the guy suggested that we play. What we got? The total low score. Okay, on this hole. Wins the 20 bucks. Deal, let's do it. And if we are tied, we'll go to the next part three, same mm -hmm. thing. Okay. And then on that one, we'll probably just be like closest to pin, even if we're not on the green on that All one. right, Wins got it. it. But here we are, let's just show the people the hole. It's a beautiful hole here, almost like a little island green. Here. Island green's got the SC bunkers. Got a lot of wind behind us. Oh man, is it blowing? We're gonna have to get the laser out to measure this one. All right, we lasered it, Blair. It's 122.4. All right. You lost a head cover. Arnold Palmer brought it back to oh, you. Thanks, man. Thanks, man. You the best. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> but I killed those guys on that tee box. All right, folks. It looks like I just got to put this one on the green, but I still have to hit a shot. Come on, man. All right, we'll take two. I didn't catch it. She's on. She's on. She's on. Man, just cannot do it today, boys and girls. Richie tried for the hole in one. Oh. Coming back, Rich. Come on back, baby. All right, folks, here's the S. And then there's the C bunker. Yeah, Scotty Cameron. And here's where I left mine. Oh, I think I just had to hit it, Rich. Ooh, you had it. I had the line. All right, I'm happy to birdie the or par the yes the island green. All right, we can do a contest. I like shank a pot and miss it, or I'll snap hook it into the thing. But if I get outside the video realm, it's like it's, okay, I right. like a decent one. That's a good one. All right, this hole we're gonna we're gonna you know you're 16 under, but on this hole we're gonna we're gonna film it. <laughs> Right line. <laughs> right now, yeah. line. Except for the whole 11 when I topped it in the water. <laughs> Somebody owe me? Who we got going? Who? Oh yeah. 
Oh yeah. Yeah. Um, I think the loser has to hand it over though, right? There you go. Yeah. Or do you wait? Or do you want to do double or no nothing on next part three? I'm down for double or nothing. All right, gang, All right. Give well, it back let's to do you. that. Yeah. Twenty yeah. double or nothing, yeah. huh? All right, folks. Here's my ball. Here. I don't know if you can see the white flag waving up there. My options are try to hood it and just run it to the bunker or just to play it safe and get out over here to the left and then I'd have a, a better angle into the pin. So that's what I got to decide here. There's not much room for mistake going on the right side. And do I really want to play out of the bunker or try to get it in the fairway, have like a 20 yarder. So I'm gonna hit this pitching wedge out there. Okay, not bad. I don't know if you can see that angle with the way I had the camera set up, but it's out there probably, I don't know, probably got a 30 yard shot. So see if I can make something of it. Sometimes in this game, you got to take your medicine. Griffer just hit a good one. They're celebrating. All right, I love it. All right, I was wrong. I got about 70 to this, but that, I like that better than being 30 or 40 out. So, all right, I got the 58 here. Medicine golf. A little right of it. Oh. oh. Great putt. That's good, buddy. Good par. Where's everybody at? Here, just step over. There you go. Now just do a split. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> Actually, let me jump. My God! Oh yeah, I jumped. I was like, "Yo, dang!" I came out of my shoes. Yeah, you got it. That's what's about having fun. All right, folks. This one's dog leg left. There's a bunker on the left that. You can carry if you pull it left if it's 245 or more. I can't tell. I miss hit it just enough. I think the wind picked up. That helped. I love, you know, this is a pretty beautiful, uh, how do I want to say it, strategic hole. I mean, you can try to bite the corner over this bunker. And I thought I left it out too far right to where I would uh, run through and be in some trouble. But I think I miss hit it just enough. That's golf. Love it. Back to the target. Yep, the right butt cheek to the target. All right, here we go, over this tree. Let me try to zoom into this pin. It's a red flag there, you can see. And I'm um, probably gonna be about 165 or so. <clears throat> All right, folks, one about 167 to this front pin. Downwind, I'm gonna hit an eight iron. Mm. All right, just on the fringe left. Good shot, just past the pin right there. The pin. Right. Nice shot from that, does he use a hybrid? Oh, she had a chance. 
Hey, the tens and tens of subscribers to my channel, they want to know, do you sleep with that hybrid at night? <laughs> that's, favorite, that's my favorite club that's, in my bag, That's dude. your favorite club. We filmed you. How far were you out up there? Uh, 168 playing 172. So just a little feather? Feathery shot? Yeah, kind of just a, a mediocre. Not, not, not too hard. Okay, because yeah. it didn't turn out mediocre. <laughs> Good shot. Hundred and eighty in the air, two hundred. Go go back to grip. Yeah. I wanna see that three wood. Okay. Can you stand? Did you get it? I, I couldn't oh, tell. Oh, hey, hold oh, on, can we do a picture real quick right here? Yeah. All of us real quick? Yeah, that's nice. All right, my crappy drive made it all the way down here. Not sure if you can see it there. And this is what I got. It's a narrow landing area. It's a pretty Tough par five, really. First time seeing it, I would say it is. All right, just got to lay up. Oh, I topped it, but then it's on land. <laughs> no, it's not. Made it to the water. Fudge. <laughs> Fudge. That's my new cuss word. Okay. All right. 212 yards, folks. The wind grabbed it finally. All right, I knew getting into that wind, I probably could have okay. right. possibly hit the four iron or the hybrid, but I didn't trust my swing right now. I hit two bad shots, so I just wanted to try to find a swing there. I'm not sure of the yardage. It's gonna go by Phil. I know I need to go get a lesson for my short game. Yeah, I know I need to go get another lesson. I tend to pull those shots. I need to give myself a little pause at the top and, and rotate better with my body. This is what it is, I'll get one eventually. But you know, I'm not playing competitive golf anymore, so I kinda, I guess I care about getting better, but not to the extent of where I need to be competitive. So anyway, See if I can make this putt for, uh, let's see, bogey. I like it. Oh, the grain! You're supposed to take, keep taking it! Go, go. Oh, Nelly, that was for Birdie. That was a line, baby. Your pants on that one? Yeah. There's a little brown stain there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're like, all right, boys and girls, we're gonna, <laughs> we're done. Uh, we're, <laughs> we're done in Myrtle. That includes the video. <laughs> Dirty Myrtle. <laughs> yep, I think we're not so much over there, other ridge. Blair should be in the bunk, uh, fairway, but oh, there's a rope. Oh, rope. <laughs> Keep going to your there area. Go. Yeah, you may. <laughs> that wasn't a bit of marriage. Is this you coming up? Yeah, I think so. All right, I don't know the yardage yet. I'll update you, but here's what I got coming in. 
this shitty drive, I still have a chance. You go, me go. Well, me go, that's in Kansas. 194, four iron over this water, into the wind. Oh, I love it. Oh, oh, good bounce! Oh. oh, yeah! Did it go in there? No, but it scared the hole. <laughs> All right, stick it, dude. Pretty cool bunkering there. The, the water goes right into it. Shot. Alright folks, that's where mine ended up, back there. Got a putt for birdie. Oh, I like that. Keep going. Ooh, oh my goodness, you see that bite? Putt. Okay. All right. This is double nothing hole. 17, man. I'm getting close to the end. Yeah. Double nothing? Yeah, we're, we're, we said that on 12. Oh, yeah. yeah. When I got my butt kicked. But that was the one hole. That was a different hole. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I offer you the double nothing. You got yeah, your chance. Deal. So, All right, right 10, Rich. 20. Rich, hold on to it for us. Hey, don't launder that money, Rich. He's retired, so he thinks he can do whatever he wants now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Good luck. <laughs> see you, bud. All right, Blair. Since this is kind of a new bet. Yeah. Flip it. See who Let's goes see first. who's going first. Let's do this. Mate, Ooh, all right. pressure's on. Pressure's on. <laughs> Take a picture of yourself. All right, Blair, here we go, brother. All right, folks, 137. I got the nine iron into this wind. Good swing. Good swing. Stay up on that tier. Just coming back. Oh, that's a tier up there. Hold up, booty hole, making us move the camera. Well, look at that booty hole. Oh. Where'd you put him? Look up there by the marker. Ooh, he wants that money's back. Oh, he oh. might be getting it back. We'll see. Oh, and your match, match and your match against Rich. Yeah. Good shot. All right, there's Blair's tee shot. If he makes the birdie, he beats me and wins the money. Double or nothing. I don't lose anything, but and there's mine. It went back down the slope, so I got a long putt. Speed. Nah, it must be into the grain because it just. Yeah, be, that's a tough one. That's a great there. Ball from there, though. I Remember, didn't watch. I didn't look at the grain. Well, and we're late in the afternoon. It started to get a little furry. All right. All right, Grifferoni. No. Oh! Nice ball. Ooh, so you're saying there's a chance still. Thank you. Oh, blasted it. Oh my gosh. Blasted it. She was tied the hole. Ooh, look at the shadowing. So I think we said the tiebreaker was whoever got closest, right? If we tied that yeah. hole. Yeah. 
so you get the, you get your money back. Oh, thank goodness! Because I was that's been rough. I mean, you have four <laughs> you have four kids. I I was feeling bad for you. Well, you told me on the tee box, you know, behind the camera, you're like, hey, look, buddy, like I know you're you know, a lot more kids than I do. You could use it a little bit more. So All I right, appreciate so, it. Right, uh, so holding fee. Yeah. So Rich gets the holding cameraman fee. Three bucks. Yeah. <laughs> you get thirty, and you get. All right, the loser has to give it to you. All right, I appreciate you. Thank you. All right, congrats. Mwah. Thanks, brother. Appreciate it. All right, folks. Chief Rich says there's 40 some bunkers on this. Uh, here's what we got. 18th hole here at Kings North, Myrtle Beach National. Big pine cone. Rich chunks it. No. Oh, gee, don't do that. Oh, Rich. Rich, you might be wet. Nah, I didn't hit that good. Damn, he, oh, but it's still in the middle of fairway. Good swing, buddy. Thanks. <clears throat> Rich is first in the sand. I might be in a second. Nope, I made it over. Good miss. Stop, stop, stop. Stupid. Just off the back. Come on, Grant, help me. There we go. Beautiful. Thank you. Nice. Good par. Thank you. Group hugs. Give me here. We love you so much. Hugs are great. Let <laughs> me carry you back. He hates it. I know. <laughs>